Hello, today I am going to discuss about the instrument tanda. What is instrument tanda? Sometimes people call instrument tanda or tanda ratio as range down ratio or rangeability. Basically, it means it is a ratio of maximum allowable span to the minimum allowable span. That is to say, it is a division between maximum allowable adjustable span to the minimum allowable adjustable span. Let me give you a scenario that may happen in the field. Suppose that we have a pressure transmitter that has a maximum calibration range of 0 to 300 pounds per square inch and based on the data sheet of this pressure transmitter, it has a turn down ratio of 20 to 1. So, basically, based on these statements, it means the technician is able to adjust the span between 300 psi and 15 psi. That is to say, the maximum allowable adjustable range is 300 psi and the minimum allowable adjustable span or range for this pressure transmitter is 15 psi maybe i give you an example so that it will be easier to understand okay Let's say I have a pressure transmitter. Alright, this pressure transmitter has an instrument range of 0 to 300 psi. This is a instrument range. Of course, this is a 0, it's a minimum, 300 is a maximum range, right? So it has turn down ratio, turn down ratio or range down ratio or rangeability of 20 to 1 based on this pressure transmit transmitter data sheet right so how do we derive a minimum allowable adjustable range as i said early, earlier the turn down ratio is maximum allowable span to minimum allowable span meaning maximum adjustable range to miss minimum adjustable range so the most important things here is we have to find what is the minimum allowable adjustable range this is the point we have to focus on it so to make the calculation simple we can do it in such a way 20 to 1 right 20 proportional to 1. So 20 is the maximum span, right? Maximum al allowable adjustable range. And 1 is the minimum allowable adjustable span. Okay, so the instrument maximum range is 300, right? So 300 psi is 300 divided by 20 multiply by 1 all right so you will get about what 15 right you will get about 15 psi and then this 15 psi is your minimum allowable adjustable span that is to say, you can adjust the process range, okay, to mini to the minimum of fifteen psi. Let's say, uh, you want to use this pressure transmitter in the field, and then the system owner want you to adjust the process range. To maybe about 40 psi to 90 psi process range so this is the range requested by system owner for you to adjust 
for this pressure transmitter. So based on this calculation, you know that 15 PSI is the minimum allowable adjustable range or span. So this 90 minus 40, you will get about 50 PSI span. And this span is the process range span right based on this requirement we are able to adjust or turn down the span until 15 psi so 15 psi and above it is allowed but if let's say you want to turn it down to 15 psi below or below the 15 psi it is not allowed based on the turn down ratio requirement okay let's say if the system owner requests you to adjust the process range to about maybe 40 to 50 psi so the difference between 50 and 40 is 10 psi so this 10 psi obviously is lower than 50 psi so it is not allowed to inst to adjust to this kind of minimum range because the minimum allowable span is 15 psi i hope that you understand let's say uh 40 maybe about the system owner uh, ask you to adjust the range to 50 to maybe uh 200 it is okay because 200 psi minus 50 is 150 psi which is more than 15 psi allowable minimum span so maybe i give you another example of the data sheet okay i have the example of the data sheet i download from internet you can see this is a pressure transmitter what the pressure transmitter data sheet and based on this data sheet you can see there is a turn down ratio here got a different range it got the range two, three, four with a different data, with a different turn down ratio or the rangeability or range down ratio. The range two is a twenty to one, range three is fifty to one, range four is hundred to one. Okay, so <clears throat> if you look at this range code, you can see range two, range three, and range four. So based on the this pressure transmitter range six inches water column for this range two where its pressure uh turn down ratio is 20 to 1. so 20 to 1 just hold on. okay so this right 20 to 1 for this range two okay and the pressure transmitter instrument range maximum range is six inches water column that means is six divided by 20 times one you will get about 0 0.3 minimum span this is the span value that you can get so calibrator span refer to the minimum calibrator span and the maximum calibrator calibrator span the maximum calibrator span is this six inches water column 0 0.3 is derived from here which is our minimum allowable span so you can easily find all these calibrated span for the minimum based on this calculated uh, step show just now maybe let me show you uh, another data sheet that I download from internet so based on this uh, flow meter data sheet from Hofer, you can see it provides you wide flow ranges with different turn down ratio okay you can find the turn down ratio for the particular transmitter the flow transmitter between 10 to 1 turn down ratio to 100 to 1 turn down ratio so when you want to find the turn down ratio you should find the highest turn down ratio so that you do not need to keep many stock of the transmitter in your storeroom All right so that's all thank you